Welcome to the channel and this Sea Dog Challenge for Nantucket. In the last part, we upgraded to our brigantine, the Silver Sky, and well, we did okay. We, we're one short on the crew at the moment, simply because I just can't find anyone to fill the slot, and I don't really want to junk someone in there because I've only got four spare prestige. We don't think there's any jobs here. Oh, we've got here deliver. We've got this one to deliver goods to Nantucket, but I want to explore the Pacific for a little while, and we, we've got some resources, so we're just going to go out and have a look around the Pacific. In fact, I might go up and see if we can do the second part of the Northwest Passage and check that out, guys. So, and then we can then take the mission to go back to Nantucket and deliver the goods. So here we are guys so we've got this up here we've got gray whales so we could sail up here we've got technology quarter deck here discover new whaling area we've got to kill Ack Ackland Dewey who's down here we could do him on the way back as well I think what we're going to do is we're going to sail up here we'll see if we can get some uh, gray whales oops we need to bump the speed up again a bit guys it always defaults back to times one whenever you start we should be okay with grey whales famous last words we're gonna just get through the ice lower the boats and here we go guys uh, okay so we're gonna, i think we're going to stick with the last used and i think we can drop our yeah we're going to keep these guys on their protective measures i think so we got wow three old grey whales this could be fun guys okay we got two that are diving you're gonna do a strike okay right he's got an evasive maneuver i think we'll do that and and he's got a um he was striking, so let's strike this one with the fasten. And I've got this the wrong way around again. Okay, he's got technical support, so uh, that's no good. He's in the wrong boat, okay. And we can't actually hit those. Yeah, he's in the wrong boat. He, I meant to bring him up to work with Daniel okay we've messed this up a little bit guys and um, he's actually immune okay he's immune we should have gone for the gray whale but we've got bleeding on him okay I think we can say so he's now going to strike on me on this one okay he's got a blind he's got a rebalance right Right, you've got a strike, you've got a strike. He has to hit this one. And he's actually resisted and he's resisted the stun. I think what we will do is he's immune, so we'll hit this one with a 28. We're gonna have to take the hit from here. And this this could yes, we've been hit with a lobtail. That's not too bad guys. That's not too bad. And <laughs> famous last words I think we need to get Eddie can now he's not contributed much so he needs to get down to his primary skill okay we got confusing maneuver a strike smooth rowing All right he's got a 28 and he's got a 38 where he has to strike there so he can take this down to a 10. He's down to a 37. These two are immune. I think he can, he can't strike this directly, but he can He can take that out. But the stun's been resisted, but these guys are immune. So I think we'll kill this one. That frees him up because that cat breaks the hat up. Okay, okay. Everything, everyone else is okay. And obviously this guy's got a fixation on right we've got a fasten we're gonna we spin on him so he's got a 33 and a 33 
He's immune. Okay. I think what we're going to do is we're going to strike him with a 33. And he can get in. That will kill him. And I'm pretty sure he's immune. So I think what we will do is we will put first aid in on me. He's now going to strike him with a lob towel. So we're going to need to get him in as a thing. This isn't a particularly good boat. This guy should be up with these. Okay, we need to get him in doing medical. So he can then, but he's now attacking this boat. Okay. Wow. Right, so you've got evasive maneuvers. You've got protective. You can do a fasten. That brings him down to 13. And right, you apply the emergency kit to him, and you do the kill. Right, we got a nice good there. Um, we definitely the next one we do need to change the crew around a bit. We're going to take 48 for that. We're going to take 96 for that. Wow, that's pretty good. And I've got to level up. And I keep on struggling with these level. Oh, we've got another one here. So I want to go for sailing. I'd love to... Evasive maneuvers. I'd like to get to here. Let's just have a check. We've got this here. Ah, I can unlock that. And add that to there. That gives me covering fire, which would be useful against pirates. We've got that. And I, I don't want to go this route. I think Helmsman, we've got Harbour Master here. I'd love to get the perfect balance, so let's unlock that. But what I would like to do is actually assign that to me. That means that if we get into a combat situation, guys, that will help me with fighting pirates and such things as that that's the that's the thought process anyway so we're going to sail across to here through the ice and we're going to reach here after weeks of sailing in frozen waters looking for a hundred year old shipwreck location we start to believe the task is impossible so do the men while you ponder about changing your course you notice some wooden boards on small icy islands let's go and explore you drop anchor and lower the whale boats to take a look at closer look at the wooden boards and the area surrounding them Upon closer inspection, it was evident the ship wrecked here long ago. The day is incredibly cold, but you order your crew to begin digging anyway. In a couple of hours, your efforts will reveal a ship. And you can see the name Albany. This is the name of the James Knight's ship. Okay, let's find the evidence. Searching the shipwreck. I hate Windows updates. After searching the shipwreck for a few hours, you discover part of the old deck. By opening the remaining drawer, you find the captain's log. It's not perfect condition, but it's readable and contains details of Knight's journey. Okay. So, is that actually updated? Northwest Passage. So, we need to go to here now. Okay. Question is, do I have enough room? Yeah, I suppose I've got enough room to do another grey whale hunt yeah I think we're going to do that I think my crew oh, I didn't check the crew Is everyone know power's not healed okay he needs to get into there nor, nor have I so I need to get in as well so he needs to get into there he needs to get into there actually he no he doesn't have the the bonus so, so you're going to have to try the ship automatically so we're gonna sail here a little way I, we should be here um while walking on your ship take a few men throwing dice no nope. i'm not gonna waste my money on stupid games hunt. right we're gonna hunt whales right lower the, the bow boats and need to hunt right we're, what we're gonna do is change this crew around now Marion has to withdraw, and I think you've got plenty there. I think I want the protection for perfect. He's got the better strikes than me, though, so 
maybe we need to take no we need him in here with Powell right so Marion needs to come into here and Powell needs to come into here so it means if he gets this tech change we can use it where before his text didn't work okay I think we cracked it now guys and of course what we do need is for these guys to be on right. so we got another big three old grey whales okay <laughs> right clever oh they're gonna bombard us okay predictive maneuver wrath of Carly wow okay um you can get straight in there you protect Daniel because I've got 50 level 50 points now he's immune and wow that that hurt poor old Daniel's stunned we need a we certainly need our medic on here I don't want to lose Daniel they're all immune okay <sighs> this could be difficult but they're all below so that means they could do a breach okay everyone else is okay right you need to do first aid on Daniel but all these guys are completely immune but we can give it a go yep oh no we actually killed him okay that's good we got well, we're down to two now right we've got two separate strikes now right you've got um, got an emergency kit confusing smooth rowing he's actually striking on me we could uh, we could go for that we don't quite have enough and these guys are immune okay let's just try yeah he's immune so what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit that there he's resisted the stun there's no point in doing that because he's immune as well if we'll just do it just for the fun of it yeah as you can see it's just immune um pro glenn's gonna get he's got lobbed straight away okay he needs he needs to get back to the first aid right he's got resuscitation that's absolute waste of time predicted maneuver were were uh, click to execute rebalance command I'm kind of I, I'm kind of inclined to hit him here that stuns him uh, well, we'll put the protected maneuver on him he's got resuscitation so that's no good we'll put that on Daniel that makes him immune he's immune he's blind ow that's gonna hurt okay so he's now going to strike onto him us okay you get the cabin ball trait right um, basically first aid kit ah, right you hit him with the evasive maneuvers we've got the wrath of Carly we're gonna hit him with that and we're gonna apply the emergency kit and recover this boat okay so what we've got to do now is take oh he's got stunned great he needs to heal he needs to heal so okay first aid kit he's got 28 he's got 28 he needs first aid he needs protective maneuvers I don't think he can he, he can can't do anything he's gonna be okay so we're gonna hit him and blind him and we could put uh, we're gonna put protective it's gonna make him immune 
Yep. I think that's it, guys. I think we can get away with this if we get a good spin. Yeah. The lobtail actually hit par, so we got good there. So I think we're going to be okay here, guys. So I'm stunned again. Wow, thank you. Okay. Yeah, he's got the the rough rough of Carly. So we got that down there. So we got a nice. So we should have a full hold to go back to. We got all the food, and we should get all that there. And let's just get the crew in the right place. Powell is in there. I'm okay. I don't really need to be in there. Glenn, so we need to put you there. You there. Where's Glenn? Glenn's in the healing. We need to get Elijah. So what we're going to do is just watch them. Pause. And then where's Elijah? Elijah needs to switch with them. And we're just going to head back to... Hololulu guys. Forbid them from gathering, teach them by example. Daniel. Ah, great. Right, everyone's healed. Enter the harbour. How are we doing guys? I'm just watching the time. Um, I'm trying to keep these consciously short. Right, new wedding area, except that. That's 23 days away. That's changed because we did have a mission to the ship, but that's actually better. So let's check. We've got the three technologies going. Um, we need the food. That's actually better. Look at that. We've got a thousand food. Wow. Okay. That, that was a good hunt, guys. Let's do it. Get down. Let's keep around a hundred. Okay, guys. Um, I think we've got everything there. Just have a quick check to see. We got crew-wise. I wouldn't mind getting a, but. None of these guys are particularly that good. Got six prestige now. I mean, I don't want to throw that away. I'd like to get that up to a 10 difference before I recruit anyone else. Because we're doing okay with the boats we got. And of course it means the lays lower and the food consumption's crow lower. Because we we're running on a crew of nine. So, actually, where's the... Uh, that's right over there, okay. Um, you're doing okay, you're doing okay. We got you sailing. Um, you could probably do going up there in the hole. I think what we can do is do a kind of great circle. We've got still got this mission down here, actually, to do. So... I think if we come down to here, we won't need, actually, yeah, we just need to, I think we'll come here, try to push harder, yep, we'll, we'll go with that, we're losing morale, but, and I think if we come and get this one, kill Auckland Dewey, I don't know who, who's the mission for Auckland Dewey? Where did that come from? It doesn't say... Okay. Um, Follow your instructions given to the Chilean smuggler. You reach a bit, big colonial house in the Savage News and near the colonial house is a big warehouse connected to the sea by a wooden pier. As you walk down the pier, a huge Maori man with silver hair exits the house, holding a rifle pointing at you. Not another step. I think you are the wrong in the wrong place. You raise your hands, keeping them away from the pistol, William. The Maori man lowers his rifles and scratches his head with it. You, you start you start explaining the reason why for your visit. 
uh, but your story does not impress him. I do not yell you, but you remember the thing. Grab him and intimidate him. No. Um, I think we're, we'll just give him cash. We've got loads of cash. Oops, I didn't see the mission. I was too quick there, guys. Okay. It's a fast quest. Fast men fear he was captured by the Spanish in Chile. Oh, yeah. Ha. So we're over here. That's a dangerous quest to do. So we're just going to check how we offer food. Actually, uh, how we offer food here. We got food for 86 days. Mm, I think we're just going to nip back to oh, uh, up to here. Then we'll come down and do this guy. Then we'll go over to that. So we'll get enough food to, to do all the missions. Okay. And you've got no newspaper. So we're just going to get back to... I'm going to get about 120 days just to make sure. I mean, I'd love to build a safe harbour, actually. But I don't have anyone with the skills. Let's have a quick look just to see. We might a long shot. Wow, he's got a 10. He's no good. He's a 10. He's a boiler. Mm, not particularly that interested. He's a 10. He's a captain. He's got that Alvin. Nah got any good whalers or harpooners not whalers Noah's you're too low that's the problem nope okay we're just gonna sail away right it's gonna come yeah, gonna come down and do this go up to there and right prepare the boats this should be a effectively it's a boss hunt is probably the best way to describe it okay last used okay yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy with this configuration now, even if he didn't spin. So we've got a bowhead, well, massive, oh, wow. Well. <laughs> hmm. Okay, let's get this here. And we're going to roll. We've got a 28 and a 28. And we got a blind. I, I kind of, I, I think I want to go straight in for him. We're just going to, I mean, actually we could kill this one outright with this strike. Okay, let's get rid of that one. So we're down two or two, two against three now. He's crash dived. Wow. That, that hurt. Okay. You need a spin. Um, okay. First aid. I think you need that on yourself first. He's dived. We can't do anything about him. But we can do something about this one. He's dead. So we're, we're now one on one. But if he, he's dived. But if he hits any of these. But he's taken two damage because we got that bleeding strike on him. Okay. And... Protective maneuver. I think you need a first aid on that. You've got absolutely nothing because you you spun the that there, and he's actually hitting this boat. So we don't need protective maneuver maneuvers on this one. But yeah, wow. Rob Carlos got his hit pretty hard there. The massive skull. Right, he needs that spin. Right, we've got a 28 and a 28. You can go first. And Elijah can hit this one. Wow, that was a good that was a good battle. And pick the food up. Okay. I think it's just how much we got we got food for 475 days got there we got grog for 130 days okay so i think what we're going to do uh, i don't want to sail through that area so what we're going to do is sail round the top of the pirates because <laughs> this is a pirate area here so i think we can get here get back to Honolulu. You're smooth running the ship, push him harder. See him. Okay. 
I keep getting minus five morale. I'm getting some bad things here. After walking the, your deck, you notice your men are pushing verbally, abusing you, certain them xenophobic traits. Silverbird, lazy. What we got here? I think we'll, we'll go with that. Minus two morale. Great. Right, we. Because of the abundance of food, no. We're going to have to keep an eye on the morale, actually, guys. How are the lifeboats? And what's the bet it's going to be sharks? Last use. Oh! Oh, great. I didn't heal up. I was too busy messing about. Um, okay. Blue whales, blue whales. This could be a bad mistake, guys. Uh, roll. Right. You've got resuscitation, and they've got a strike on these straight away. Retreat. Back to the ship. Yeah, that was a, a bad mistake, guys. But I couldn't. You can see that strike that went in. If that had got any of the others, yeah. Um, there's Carlos. He should be there. He should be there. Elijah is in the boat. Powell should be. Um, yeah, you can wait. Yeah, that was a, a bit of a fail. Major fail there, guys. Never mind. We got the the area opened up anyway so okay new wedding area um new wedding area there so let's go shoot back to Honolulu and I'm just gonna keep track of my crew just make sure they're healing up right let's move Powell into there um it's gonna I'm just gonna check the morale yeah, the morale's not better. Glad to have them all crew now. Um, yeah, we need to we need to perk the morale up a bit. Man, craftsman man dies. Ah, right, we've actually got something positive here, guys. Okay, the crew's all healed up now. Oh. Uh, back in Honolulu. Yeah, I mean, it goes to show if, you, if you're not careful, guys, that's how you can come unstuck or get get the reward for that. This is eight, 83 days away, level 7. I thought we'd done that. Kill Dixon Venom. Okay, right, let's. We've got loads of cash. Let's get back up enough to get back to. Of course, we've got all the food here, which we got from that initial the, the boss battle. That should let's go keep 125, 128. And I keep looking, but and of course we we're not gaining the prestige because of course that we didn't get any prestige for that battle, which is unfortunate. But I think it's time to get back to the Atlantic, guys. And I think we're going to get back to the Atlantic, cash in some of these uh, things. There's nothing else here, so I think what we can do, just uh, I mean, we haven't been to Cape Town yet, actually, I'm sorry, haven't we? Okay. There's although there's not anything at Cape Town as such, to be honest. Um, Actually, let's just come in on the. Actually, let's do this. Whoops. Let's investigate across here. See, there's some waiting grounds here, but we're not actually seeing them. But I think maybe if we come across to Cape Town, we might as well visit Cape Town just to show you guys. Uh, Uh, yeah, we'll give him 250 experience points. 
into the harbour. Right, we got newspapers. And it's just going to stock back up again. And say we got loads of cash. So, let's say just to show you guys, there's, there's nothing really here. It says newspapers, but there's nothing in the newspapers, which is a bit of a shame. And all we can hire here is cabin boys. Now we've got this mission here, but I don't really want to do that mission until, who is it? We got, a, oh, is Elijah's 10? I'm that. Okay, we could come up and do this mission. I've got the trait now. Okay, this could go badly wrong, guys. After sailing around Africa for coast for several weeks, the scream resounds amongst the crew. Captain Smoke Ahoy, we run to the deck looking in the dark smoke column coming from the small island on the horizon. So this is the Lost Boys. Uh, let's get closer. Our, we, you order the ship's course adjusted and sailed in the island's direction. One of the men hands you your spyglass. You inspect the island's coastline. It looks like a shipwreck happened a few days prior and some men now desperately waving their arms in your directions lit the ship's remains in order to draw their attention. So we cast the anchor. You order the whale boats lowered and paddle in the direction of the smoke source. Three men rush into the water, welcoming your boats and approaching them. It looks like they've seen on the island a few days, judging by their faces. Let's beach the boats and have a look. Your boats reach the island while the three castaways become your crew. Look, take a look around. The camp looks built like the ship's remnants of boards and salt encrusted pieces of furniture. It looks like they've been here a few days, maybe more. The wind changes the sudden smell of death and rotten corpses. Yeah, well, we'll walk in the survivors' directions. The men run in your direction. The three survivors reach you out of breath. They look tired and scarred by many days in the sun. While they, they smile at you, they feel shiver run down your spine. Their faces look sinister. Who are you? What happened? One of the men steps forward, clearing his throat. Captain, I am Alward of the Intrepid's first mate. We are chasing a white whale under... Captain Gardiner's command when we were attacked by a pirate ship. Our ship was set on fire and we barely made it to this island alive. What happened to Captain Gardiner? Elwood looks back at his mates before speaking again. Captain Gardiner was taken prisoner by the infamous pirate Diablo to left him to die in the corpse of the Simon Vultures. Uh, you do not have the cannibal trait. Order your men to have weapons. Calm down. We are here to help you. Okay. Elwood composes himself and men look more relaxed. I need to go home, Captain. Please bring me home. Elwood and his mates look exhausted on the verge of madness, even without looking at the men. You know that it would be safe to have them on your would it you know it would not be safe to have them on your ship, okay. You would not we do not have room, we will send you some supplies. We we'll leave you food and water and search for you someone somebody to rescue, I promise. Bring one of you can bring one of you with us and send then send a we can bring one of you with us and then send a rescue ship. Okay. Um, I, I, I think we'll do that. No, we will not spend another day here. Die. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I was trying to find a way to avoid this. And of course, we're going to have Elijah and we're going to have San Diego. So we're going to have to, we're going to go in heavy for this. I'm not going to take a doctor with me. He's got this. I've got this as well. He's got grenades. This could go badly wrong. You see here we've got Larkin, Dexter and Elwood. Okay. And he's actually going to attack us. Right. You kill Larkin outright. That takes the pressure off of me. Broad Elijah gets smacked in the, in the face. Okay, he's also having a go at me. Uh, I think... Okay, you hit him. Okay. Right, we got 12 on me. We're two both stunned, great. It's all up to you, San Diego. Right, the bleeding resistance from me is working. Right, 24. Uh, he's hitting... I think we're, we're 
Miss. Oh, come off it. Right, they're all ganging up on Elijah. Right, he's got... Uh, right, you shoot him. You shoot him. Now, hopefully, if Elijah survives... Which he's probably... N oh, he's just survived. Okay. We need a good spin here to kill Dexter. Otherwise, poor old Elijah's dead. Covering fire. Okay. Got no idea what covering fire actually does. Yes. Wow. We actually won that. <laughs> For some strange we get some blubber. We get some food. We get that there. We get this, this, and this. Oh, we got a nice... The pirate Diablo is well known for his savagery and greed. We hope he's keeping Gardner alive to ask for a ransom. We need to rush to his lair located somewhere in Madagascar. Ah, uh, oh, we got a nice cutscene. Was my travel an ordeal to test my faith? We were sailing the seas of nightmares where the light of the shepherd was feeble and its flock was scattered in despair. Quest completed. The last, the lost boys. Let me just write that down. That would be the title for the video. Before leaving the island, your men check the, the beach, looking for more survivors and valuable objects. One of them hands in a cookbook written by the Rachel's cook, with Rachel's cook way of characters place crafting plus three. Okay, that'd be useful. I think. Well, first thing we need to do is we need to get Elijah in the sick bay along with San Diego right guys what we're going to do is we're going to sail back to Cape Town and I'm going to call the video there I'm going to have a think about whether we're going to go over and carry on with this main mission or whether we're going to go back north and actually see if we can get a better crew obviously our guys got to heal so this is where I'm going to leave it guys hope you've enjoyed the video hope you found it interesting until next time whatever you do enjoy your gaming